No days for schools in our area just keep adding up, and, and now there's some concern about the potential impact on I-STEP testing. WSBT's James Fillmore is here, and James, you know, several districts are hoping the test will be pushed back. Well, that's right, Rick, but they may be in luck. I-STEP testing is supposed to happen in April, but the Indiana Department of Education sent out an email saying it would discuss the possibility of extending the testing window to compensate for the days lost. Bremen Schools has missed seven days so far in 2014 due to the cold and snow, but the superintendent is not worried about I-STEP testing for his students. We assess students uh, every two to three weeks, so we really have a pretty good handle on where the students are at, what standards they've mastered, where we need to spend a little more time. Even if the I-STEP testing window was extended, he says they would make the most of every day school was in session. He also has confidence in the abilities of his teachers. Parents we spoke to feel the same way. The kids are, are up to date, they're current, we're constantly informed about what they're doing. And uh, we've, we've got a good system here, a good school system, and I, I know they'll do well. In addition to the email from the Indiana Department of Education, Superintendent Russ Michael was contacted by a superintendent's association, asking him if he had any ideas on how districts could make up these days. Whatever happens, he believes the kids are well rested from all the snow days and eager to learn. I think kids are uh, probably ready to come back to school. Uh, they love to see their friends, spend time with their friends, uh, along with the school uh, experience that they have. The Bremen superintendent says they have used up all of their makeup days, so any more snow days will have to be added at the end of the school year. Reporting live in the studio, I'm James Fillmore, WSBT Channel 22 News. This harsh winter is taking its toll on...